Hey friends, I'm just sitting here reading some very good stories and looking over at our gerbil bear. So if you can hear a, lo a little bit of chewing and running around, he's right over here in the room with me. So he's safe and sound, just like I'm safe and sound at home where you, where you should be. And hopefully you're enjoying our stories. And I have a new one for you today. And this is called A Kiss for a Little Bear. And the story is by Elsie Homelund Minerick. That is a big mouthful of words. But the pictures are by Maurice Sendak, and he also did Where the Wild Things Are, which is one of my all-time favorite books. But this one is very cute, too. And I wanted to read it to you. It's out of this big collection of children's books. This picture makes me happy, said Little Bear. Hello, Hen. This picture is for Grandmother. Will you take it to her, Hen? Yes, I will, said Hen. Grandmother was happy. This kiss is for Little Bear, she said. Will you take it to him, Hen? I will be glad to, said Hen. Then Hen saw some friends and she stopped to chat. Hello, Frog, I have a kiss for Little Bear. It is from his grandmother. Will you take it to him, Frog? Okay, said Frog. But Frog saw a pond and he stopped to swim. Hi, Cat. I have a kiss for Little Bear. It is from, from his grandmother. Take it to him, will you, Cat? Hi, here I am in the pond. Come and get the kiss. Ooh, said Cat but he came and got the kiss. Cat saw a nice spot to sleep. Little skunk, I have a kiss for Little Bear. It is from his grandmother. Take it to him like a good little skunk. Little skunk was glad to do that, but then he saw another little skunk. She was very pretty and he gave the kiss to her and she gave it back and he gave it back. And then Hen came along. Too much kissing, she said. But this is Little Bear's kiss from his grandmother, said Little Skunk. Indeed, said Hen. Who has it now? Little Skunk had it, and Hen got it back. And she ran to Little Bear, and she gave him the kiss. It is from your grandmother, she said. It is for the picture you sent her. Take one back to her said Little Bear. No, said Hen, it gets all mixed up. The skunks decided to get married and they had a lovely wedding. Everyone came and Little Bear was the best man. And that's the end of that story. It's a short one, but I think it's kind of funny with all the animals kissing each other and skunks getting married. A silly story. I hope you liked it and we'll see you next time.